How you doing? Unbelievable performance. Nice. I love how you just involved everybody. We have fans here and they've never really done that. Really? You got everybody going. Oh, you have to do that. Great it's energy. Good job. Yeah, great job. Thanks, guys. Happy to have you here. So, um, I have a couple questions off the top. How did you get the name on Three Days Grace? Um, actually... Um, what's your favorite color? Um, actually, um... And where, where are you from? Um, actually, um... <laughs> this is, no, this is profound. This yeah. is a profound interview. I had to. No, I heard that you hate those questions, oh, right? So yeah, people the, they yeah. give you them all the time? Do people all this, actually you, ask you that? Yeah, oh yeah. You get asked the same questions over and over and over again. Yeah. It gets a little bit annoying, but, but you know, you're, we still... But you were polite, though. We tested you still and see your how question, nice yeah. he was? We're Canadians. True. We're Canadians. True. There you go. So you started working on it in Toronto and mm -hmm. decided to head to Cottage Country in Ontario. Why mm -hmm. was that so important for you as a band? Well, I think we, as a band, we work really well together when we're just sitting by ourselves and, the, you know, with no distractions, nothing else around us. You know, we started working on the record here and it, you know, it got a little bit, we just kind of lose focus, you know, sometimes when we're in a big city. So mm -hmm. we just had to take off and just basically seclude ourselves from everything else, you know. And it was a good experience. And it was great. It right? worked out really well, yeah. And one of the songs you said came together really well was Pain, which we're going to be performing later mm -hmm. on. We can't wait for that. It sounded yeah. great earlier. So what was that experience like? Because I heard that you guys were chilling out, playing the guitar, mm -hmm. hanging out, and it all came together. Yeah, no, for sure. It, um, we've always, like, from the, from the time we met, um, we've always sat with acoustic guitars and, and played music, you know, around campfires and stuff, because we're from a small town, so we're really used to sitting with, uh, you know, just the bare, you know, bare bones. So we wanted to do that, writing this record, you know, mm -hmm. just, and it, it worked out well. Yeah, we yeah. wrote the songs Once we wanted to. Once we broke down, you know, just got back to our roots, you know, it was all easy. It kind of wrote itself, I guess, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. It all came together. Mm -hmm. now, speaking of small towns, we actually have a question outside, an audience question. We have Tim standing by, and I know it has something to do with that. So, Tim, what's going on? Hey, what's up? I'm standing outside with Sam. Right? Yep. And Sarah. And Sinead. And Sam has a question for the band. Sam, what's your question? Um, I know that you guys are from a really small town, and I was wondering how often you go home now that you guys are huge rock stars. <laughs> we had a chance to go home. Actually, actually, we're going uh, next week. We got, we have like 20 minutes off in between tours right now, so we're gonna go uh, back back home for about 15 minutes and then back out on the road. So we try to as much as we can. I mean, you know, we just love. I mean, it, after after being south of the border and other places, it, may, it really makes you appreciate your own country, you know. So and it's cool tonight. We're, play, we're playing in our own backyard, you know. It's with. Yep. <laughs> Yeah. So you're chilling out this weekend. Some people are going to cottages, yeah. doing some fishing. Right? I'm, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go to a cottage this weekend. Yeah. Relax. Yeah. Relax. Yeah. Decompress. Yeah. Just chill. You need yeah. to just chill, right? Catch some fish. You know. You a big fisher? Yeah. Okay. When I get the time. Yeah. yeah. It's hard to fish on the road though. Wow. Outside. Um, yeah, we, we, got a we got a lot of fishers. Yeah. Fishermen. Yeah. You're gonna go reel them in. But um, from the song. That really stood out to me. I love it. It's um, I'd rather feel pain than nothing at all. Mm -hmm. Where did that line come from? Um, you know, the last the last couple years on the road, I, I ended up dealing with a lot of things. You know, I had personal issues and I had demons that I felt like I had to deal with. And there was a point where I really felt that I was just numb to everything that was going on around me. You know, and that that song, Pain, is just it's about that. It's about wanting to feel something rather than nothing at all. You know, so. Is that the, be the best way you deal with your, your experiences, though? Put them through your lyrics? Oh, yeah. Put them out? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. The lyrics on this record are basically, you know, taken from my journal over the last couple of years. Open book, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. People relate to it. So cool. Absolutely. Do you want to go outside to the window? Yeah, let's go yeah, let's do it. Say hi. Keep the fans happy. Okay, so you were screaming for them. There you go. Here's Adam and Neil. And his son, Salon Grass. Hey. What's this happening? is an oldie, but I love this song. It is everything about you. Three days grace. It's a lot of love. Mm. 